All right, got a 95 Jeep Grand Cherokee. I've got too much toe in, I believe. I'm gonna check it right now. I don't know if you can eyeball that tire on the front pointing in. And that one looks like it's pointing in as well. So, done some checking and I think what I'm supposed to have is an eighth of an inch toe in. And that's the difference between the front of the tire and the rear of the tire of the front tire. So I've got two inch angle iron I'm going to use and a strap. I'm going to put uh, one on each side. Got the other one right there. And check and see what I've got. Okay, I'll pause out here and when I get to that point, I'll start recording again. Okay, I'm back. I got the angle iron put on there. Just got them about center line of the wheel. You can see there, on top of that flange of that angle iron is about center. And I ro rotated it back just a little bit back here to allow for a measuring tape to go all the way across the other side without hitting anything. So same on that side. And I jacked the Jeep up till the tires are just barely off the ground. I'm not worried about a jack stand with it just an eighth of an inch off the ground. So back tires are blocked. E brake set in park. So jacking it up off the ground will uh, take any tension that may be on there from worn ball joints. And that's another thing, that's not a fix. Doing this alignment's not a fix for bad ball joints or any of your suspension parts. So this is good enough to get you to an alignment shop. All right, I'll throw a tape on there and I'll start recording then again. Okay, I got the measuring tapes on there. I don't know if you can read it or not. But we've got 68 and 3 quarters to the inside of the leg on the front. Sixty-nine and a half. So I've got three quarters of an inch toe in, according to this measurement. So, it's supposed to be an eighth. So to adjust that, right up here, hope it's not too dark. There we go. I see adjustment right there for your toe in. So you knock these nuts loose here and on mine they're 15 millimeter and then you've got a right hand left hand thread coupler there and you turn that whichever direction you need to adjust your toe in or toe out until you get within an eighth of an inch and then tighten them back and then you're good to go so I'm going to do that right now and I'll get back with you in a sec okay I got it Pretty darn close, I think. 69 and a 16th. Sixty-nine and three sixteenths. It gives me an eighth inch toe in. So I had to use a pipe wrench on there, a little WD-40. On there. So now I just got to tighten them clamps back up and go give it a test drive. All right, hope this helps you guys out. Out there, this is my first time. I think it's going to be fine. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. And thumbs up. Appreciate it. Have a good one.